We have seen admitted to evidence extremely provocative nude photos of both Jody Arias and the victim in this case, Travis Alexander. In my mind, these photos show that a physical attack by Travis Alexander on Jody Arias, the way she says it, is absolutely impossible. We have Jody Arias there in the home starting around 3 a.m. She comes over, they start having sex, they have sex all night, all during the day. They have a marathon sex session. So he gets in the shower and it looks like um, these photos she's intentionally taking with a digital camera. She's taking pictures of him, side photos of him, apparently like flexing his biceps. Within literally less than 50 seconds, the murder commences. I don't see how an, a, an attack can be made on her and she shoots and stabs him to death and it commences within 40 seconds of the last seemingly happy sex photo in the shower. What it says to me is that in those 40 seconds she has gotten a gun and a knife and commences to stabbing him. He was not shot to death. A lot of people have asked me, what do these crime scene photos, they're horribly gruesome, they're horrific, what do they show? What effect will they have on Travis's family? Having lived through the murder trial of my fiance, I recall even seeing his bloody shirt sitting on the council table, dealt me a horrible, horrible emotional blow that I relive now, 30 years later. I cannot begin to fathom the effect that these photos will have on Travis Alexander's life.